Hello you gorgeous people of the interwebs. I hope you're having a fan dubby dozy day today. Today I've got such a cutie little unboxing here um, from my cutie little lion for our anniversary. Yes, it was our wedding anniversary on the 1st of April. Yes, we know that is April Fool's Day. And yes, it was deliberate. We are the April Fools. And this year it was seven years, which means it was copper. The traditional wedding gifty type thing, element thing. We were talking about it and we're like, oh, what do we get? You know, I didn't, do we even get each other gifts? We wanted to get each other something, so. We kind of, we went down the copper route, but we did it in a kind of boozy way with him getting me a uh, copper gin and me getting him a copper whiskey. We had a whale of a time. If you follow me on Instagram, go and follow me on Instagram, start by Gwenny. Um, you would have seen in my stories the sort of rundown of the day, rundown of the day, the excitement of the day. We went to the place that we had our wedding reception. We went there for brunch and uh, then we came home and we had a little bit of a movie marathon. We watched Cruella and we watched the new Spider-Man. Loved them both. They were both fantastic films. Five stars. Um, and then we went out for dinner to our favourite restaurant. It was a very exciting day. Uh, and on top of the copper themed stuff I gifted hubby for our anniversary, uh, I also bought him a couple of pairs of boots that he was really, really keen on, uh, really, really wanted. And I'm very happy to say they were both wins. They fit him beautifully. They look fabulous on him. And he is a happy lion chappy. Now he had also ordered this for me yeah. uh, but this didn't come in until the day after first thing in the morning while well, we might might have been feeling the effects of overindulging for our anniversary um so we'll get into that and i'll show you what the line got for me but if you are new to my channel and you didn't know that our anniversary was on the april fool's day and you're wondering why it might be on april fool's day and you haven't seen enough of me and the lion to have figured that out for yourselves then welcome my name is gwenny and i love luxury in all of its glorious forms and if you love luxury in all of its glorious forms then go ahead hit subscribe Subscribe and ring my bell so you don't miss out on any of my shenanigans and uh, yeah give the videos you enjoy the thumbs up love and don't forget to follow me on Instagram as I said earlier right enough faffing you're not here for this you're not here for the backstory you want to see the goods <laughs> and I'm gonna show you the goods yeah recognize that lining man i love this packaging we have a little bit of pepper to keep everything in place we have this gorgeous little box with this red red ribbon lovely and because it was ordered directly from gucci gucci cootie patootie we got another little Gucci bag. We have a receipty poos. We have the thank you for shopping. We look forward to assisting you again at Gucci. And then we have my little my little gift card here. Happy anniversary, my beautiful wife. And lots of kisses. Oh, and the red, the colour of love if you like. I have had a look and I wasn't going to be sharing this with you until next week because I should be filming my Super Jacob tag video but I want to use this and I couldn't wait any longer so I thought I'd share it with you now. I'm so happy. I'm so happy with this. It's the little things. It's the little things that make us happy. I've got lots of care booklet and gubbins there. Lots of care booklet-y stuff. And in here, oh, this little dust bag here. Da, 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 da. Yes! It is the Gucci, what do they call it? Supreme Key Pouch. 
It is like the Louis Vuitton clay or key pouch, but this one is slightly different. And it is in the Gucci Supreme monogram coated canvas. <gasps> yes, let's have a little look at her. Let's have a little look at her. So the first thing you see, you've got the leather tab on the zip here. Uh, you've got a lovely long zip. Now, I don't usually like the tails on these zips on things like the... Uh, toiletry pouches from Louis Vuitton puts me right off but on here I don't mind so much because it's a small item an SLG if you will and it just makes it easier to get in it just makes it easier to get in it is a key pouch so we have the little key ring attached by this chain here and the way the key key ring on the Gucci's version of the key pouch works is you pull it out and then you twist it. Stamped into the side of the key holder here it's got Gucci made in Italy as well. I am over the moon to have this little piece. Um, I'm having a bit of an SLG refresh at the moment aren't I with my new Fendi card holder which I'm loving by the way and this key pouch and this is my first piece of Gucci supreme canvas and I want more. Oh yes, I want more. <laughs> now you might be saying, but Gwenny, you already have the LV clay. Why do you need this as well? Hmm. Well, apart from being a bit greedy. So, oh, this is a good time to share my bag of the day. And in fact, this has been my bag of the working week being two days long. But I go into the office yesterday and today. I have been using my OG the OG, my 25 year plus Bally Hobo. It is fabulous. I still need to do a video on this one. And in here I've got all sorts of gubbins, uh, including, where are you? Including my Louis Vuitton clay. Now Miss Bally is 25 plus years old. This clay is 2002 or 2003 I always forget which year um, but it was made in 2002 and I think I might have bought it at the beginning of 2003 I forget either way she's knocking on 20 all right um, and I use this pretty much every day I use it with my front door key on the key chain and the car key just dropped in there. I use this every single day and I love it. And she's knocking on, she's old. She's seen some things, let me tell you. Sticky nightclub floors dropped on, trodden on, you name it. She's, uh, she's, She's my ride or die. She's been there with me. She's done it all, seen it all. So yeah, I decided that I wanted an alternative to give her a little bit of a rest. Yeah, give her a little bit of rest. Give the old girl a chance to put her feet up for a bit. And I was tempted to go for another Louis Vuitton clay because I'm interested to see how this has changed from 2002, 2003 to the newer model. I believe the newer models are slightly larger. I know the canvas isn't going to be as good and actually I've got to say the canvas on the Gucci feels pretty darned robust so I've no doubt this is going to last. Look at me collecting different monograms at the moment. Me Fendi, me Louis and me Gucci. Once upon a time and not that long ago I would have been of the opinion that I wanted everything matchy matchy, matchy matchy. It was always handbags and matching wallets. But these days I feel a lot more free, a lot more easy about mixing things up. I seem to have broken that curse. I have broken the curse of it must be matchy matchy, for I am willing to mix and match, chop and change. I'm not going to do a big comparison video, I will save that until I've used this piece. Um, a little while I just can't wait to get in her but I am going to switch out my keys right now and um, then just see what she feels like the Louis 
I mean, lump, a bit lumpy at the moment because it's got me, um, I'm not doing a comparison. I'm not doing a comparison. Stop it, Gwenny. Stop, 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 stop. And we're in. She has got, there you go, you can see there. She has got my house key on the keychain and the car key inside. Oh, I I'm so excited to have this little piece. Um, I love SLGs and I know people say, don't waste money on SLGs, save it for the big bucks purchases because, I mean, this was £225, £235. This is £225 or £35. So that's, you know, almost £500 towards a handbag. But these give me so much joy as well. I don't need 50 of them, but I'm quite happy to have two of them. In fact, I have got my eye on a third. Cheeky little Celine one. And that is all, my little unboxing of my wonderful first piece of Gucci Supreme Canvas. Do you have this piece? Do you have Gucci Supreme Canvas? What do you think of it? Please let me know in the comment section down below. And I do hope you have enjoyed this video. If you did, please show it the thumbs up love. And until I see you, yes you, for the next video, please stay safe, be kind to yourselves, be kind to others, stay fan dabby dozy and bye bye